Hi, I'm Valder Beebe. I'm the host and a visionary of That Celebrity Interview. Good day, and thank you for being here on the Valder Beebe Show. Hopefully you enjoyed the music while I was gone, but I'm back. Told you I'd come back with a great guest. I've got Chef Jamie Gwynn. You know I really like her. I'm always inviting her because she gives us information for us. Not so good at food, people. We're good at eating. We're just not good at fixing it. And she's got some <laughs> easy way. And she's coming on and talking about Easter treats. I like that. And it's Easter already. So get ready and be prepared. Chef Jamie Gwynn, welcome back to the Valder BB Show. Valder, I love being with you. Thank you for always having me back. And by the way, I say that if you love to cook or love to eat, then we can definitely be friends. And that's why you and I are friends. You love to eat. <laughs> that, I love to eat. I'm good. I'm so good at eating. I am. And I yes. eat all the time. They cut, my husband say I graze. You know that term. Because yes, uh, I have course. a small frame. Yeah, but I, I, I developed a high metabolism in my later years in life. So I'm always mm. eating. So I'm looking for some good Easter treats and some spring treats. What do you got for me? You got it. Lucky you. I want to eat with you. All right. I have some food and drink finds to usher in spring, and I know you're ready. Let's start with ham. It's a must at Easter, right? My go-to is Kentucky Legend for so many reasons. Now, it has really fabulous flavor. What I love is that it's double smoked. It is, by the way, nation's the nation's number one natural juice ham. And what you'll love is that it's easy. It's just heat and eat. Now, they have a variety of sizes and smoke flavors for every gathering. So you could take a whole Kentucky Legend ham and simply glaze it with peach preserves, or you could use their quarter or their half ham and add deliciously smoky flavor to your favorite signature dish or appetizer. I like a big thick slice with eggs in the morning really delicious. Now, how about a unique spin on a holiday appetizer? I love this too. These are quiche cups made with pearls sliced California black ripe olives, and they are the perfect individual brunch delight. So you could eat one or two or eight, maybe. People who love olives, they love and trust pearls. 100% grown and packed in sunny California, which is my home state, <clears throat> and picked at the peak of freshness, you can really see and taste the difference. So there's no mushy olive here, right? They're definitely a pantry staple of mine. I love that Pearls is committed as well to keeping jobs in the U.S. and they ensure the highest quality olives in their cans and cups and jars. So you want to look for the sunny yellow packaging. Okay, Valder, you've got to see this. Are you ready for something so fun? Yes, I am because okay. I'm hungry. Okay. You've made me hungry now. Go I ahead. I made you hungry? Well, that's good. I've done my job. Okay, check out this sweet treat. Now, it looks like an ordinary marshmallow, right? But okay. one bite reveals a creamy, sweet milk chocolate core. This is a stuffed puff. So it is a milk chocolate <laughs> filled marshmallow. Super fun to add to your Easter egg hunt, right? And now this season, Stuffed Puffs came out with limited edition bags in colors, sunflower yellow, bubblegum pink, and daydreaming blue. So we are ushering in spring. Now they make an amazing s'more around a campfire or your backyard barbecue. But if you want a quick hack, I pop one into the microwave for seven seconds and you have what I call instant gratification s'mores if that's not so cool and that is so cool i thought you were gonna tell me i had to make that <laughs> no. <laughs> i love it no 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 you don't have to worry but I, I do have something for you and i to toast that marshmallow with and i mean literally clank a glass by the way because you'll already have toasted the outside for your s'more you don't have to be a mixologist to whip up a delicious cocktail. And I think we all need something to celebrate right now. So please look for the new release of Smirnoff Zero Sugar Infusions Lemon and Elderflower. It is so good, Valder. With a splash of soda water, fabulous. That citrus flavor, the subtle notes of the elderflower come through beautifully and it's very refreshing. It has zero sugar, so you'll still reach your summer bod goals. And then I have another cocktail, a spring inspired Moscow mule that I make. It combines strawberries and lime with the world's number one vodka, which is Smirnoff number 21 vodka. It's the quality and the price that make it the go-to vodka when entertaining. So if you're looking for information and these tasty recipes, you want to visit dailylounge.com. And then I would love to see you on social at Chef Jamie Gwen. 
You guys reminded me that uh, Chef Jamie Gwynn is the former Master Chef judge, and she's providing these tips for drinks and snacks today. I think. Do you have one more tip about my Easter table, my Easter meal? How do give me a liven liven it up because we're hoping we can have people over one day. Yeah. <laughs> Yes, of course. One day, right? And even if you're socially gathering uh, outside and, and keeping safe, which we are in my house, you know, with my son who's just turned a, a year old, I have a great idea for you for your Easter table, Valder. Um, in the base of your vases, let's say you buy just a fresh bouquet of flowers, right? Instead of just sticking them right into the vase, fill the vase with colored, brightly spring-esque jelly beans, and then stick all of the uh, of the flowers in, right, all the stems. It really adds lively color to the table. It would make a lovely centerpiece and super simple with a bag of jelly beans, right? Can't be beat. I love that. And it's affordable too, Chef Jamie Gwynn. That's why exactly. they say you're a chef this chef to the stars thanks for taking the time to stop by the valder bb show you know i always i'm always trying to get tips i was taking notes while you were talking but i have to go back and listen Good. to my own interview <laughs> <laughs> thank you valder so much i'll see you soon thanks for being here chef jamie gwen thank you for having me hi i'm valder bb i host the valder bb show broadcast on radio and television and this is my phone pouch my phone pouch is a great invention. It allows me to go hands-free, pocket-free, purse-free, even belt-free. Head on over to myphonepouch.com.